Hi friends, I hope you're ready to practice some measuring with me today. I went around my house and kind of wanted to measure some different things that I have in my house. For instance, I wanted to measure my whiteboard, um, I measured a carpet, I measured, well, we're gonna measure my hallway behind me, just a bunch of different little things that I measured around my house and I used different items to measure. So in this case, to measure my whiteboard, I use these little plastic Easter eggs to measure my whiteboard. And we're gonna see how wide my whiteboard is using Easter eggs. So count with me my eggs, and that'll tell us how wide my whiteboard is. Are you ready? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So my whiteboard is nine Easter eggs wide. How about that? I was curious to see how my how wide my hallway is too. So we'll do that in a second. But I used Easter eggs to measure. I also used, in some cases, if you can see that, I used a quarter. And something else I used is shoes. So let's hop up and we're gonna see how many steps long my hallway is. Now I have bigger feet than my girls do, so I bet if Landry measured the hallway with her footsteps, it would take more steps. Mine doesn't take as many steps as maybe Landry's does, but let's see how many steps of my footsteps it takes to measure our hallway. All right, come with me. We'll see if we can do this. Okay, so I'm going to walk over here to my hallway. It's right here, it's right behind where I was sitting. And I'm gonna put my feet right at the beginning of my hallway. Do you see my feet down there? My blue socks? Okay, so when I put my feet, I'm gonna put them like this, heel to toe. Do you see how that is like that? And we're gonna count. So we're gonna start with this. This foot here is gonna be one. So it'll be one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23. So my hallway was 23 of my feet long. Like I said, I bet if Tegan or Landry tried to do that, it wouldn't be as long for them because they have smaller feet than I do. That's one thing that we were gonna measure. So I wonder if you guys wanna try to measure your hallways with your feet, then maybe get your grown up to measure the hallway with their feet and see which takes more feet, more steps to measure that hallway. Um, let me show you some pictures of other things that I measured. Let me think about this. I measured an Easter egg. I used an Easter egg to measure my board, but I also measured an Easter egg with a quarter. And I have a picture of that. So that Easter egg, when I measured it, was two quarters. Can you see that? And then I measured a piece of paper using a quarter, and it was, count them. I'll give you a second. Can you count them on the picture? That was 11 quarters long, that paper was. And a quarter is about an inch. So it's about 11 inches for that paper. Let's see, what else did I measure? I measured my carpet in my living room using shoes. Can you count how many pairs of shoes I used? I used eight shoes to measure my carpet. Guess what else I measured with those shoes? Tegan, how big is Tegan using those shoes to measure? Did you count them? Tegan is six shoes long if we use shoes to measure her. Guess what else I measured with shoes? Landry. How big is Landry? Did you count the shoes? Landry's only five shoes big. She's smaller than Tegan is, isn't she, by a whole shoe? <laughs> That's just crazy. So then I took my shoe and I wanted to see how many quarters long my shoe is. So I took off my shoe and I lined up the quarters. Can you count the quarters to see how long my shoe is? 
it's 10 quarters long, right? And then I used quarters to also measure some things in my kitchen. I measured a croissant. Do you see that? How many quarters was that? That was five quarters. I also measured a pineapple. How long was my pineapple? That one was 14 quarters. Did you count all those quarters? And I measured a little chair that we had. Remember the pink chair I showed you the other day in one of our other videos or on our Zoom meeting maybe it was when we were doing colors. I held up my pink chair. That chair is 12 quarters long. Isn't that crazy? I also used Easter eggs. I told you I used Easter eggs to measure my board here. I also used them to measure how wide my stairs are that go upstairs in my house. Can you see that picture? And then you can count the eggs across there. I think there were 18 eggs that crossed that picture, that stair in that picture. So you guys can take a look at that. What can you measure with at your house? You can use paper clips, you can use apples, you can use your hands, you can use your own shoes. Try to measure some things around your house and let me know how it goes. I would love to know how many steps long your hallway is. And I would love to know, I would be very interested to know how many steps long your hallway is compared your feet to your grown-up's feet. That would be really neat to see. I hope you guys enjoy this. I hope you have fun measuring everything in your houses and I will see you again soon. Bye.